hello guys welcome back to this channel and in this video we are going to be talking about layers we are going to see how you can work with layers in adobe illustrator and i'm using cs3 so first of all to activate these windows or these layers you go to window come and mark layers they'll be on this side so windows you activate the layers and they will be able to show up here on the right hand side so as you know these layers help us to organize the work into distinct levels that can be edited and views individually so like individual units and every illustrator ca3 document contains a list of layers creating multiple layers lets you to easily control your work the way the artwork is printed displayed and edited so you can use the layers palette oftenly while you are creating a document so it's crucial to always understand what it does and how it uses how you can use it and today we are going to be exploring this area so as you can see <coughs> on every palette it contains the delete section so that one when you want to delete the area it automatically deletes it next year we have what they call the create new layer you can create a new layer like when you click it another new layer is formed there here we have what they call the create sub layer when you click it that also this layer it's the first layer but inside that layer there is another layer layer 3 so that's what they call the sub layer and at times here you always have the lock the lock icon so you can unlock and lock it that's it and we have what they call the eye icon or hide and show so when you do like you hide show it hide show it so that's how it works it's called the eye icon which stands for hide or show i guess that's it guys and this one is called the make and release clip masking so like when you want something to go behind some like you're blending a cd cover giving it an image under the other side giving it its real texture so that's it guys thanks for watching please subscribe